live images of the opening ceremony of the 43rd regular meeting of the Conference of Heads of Government of the Caribbean Community, CARICOM. To fairness to all and to put the development of people above everything else, I pledge to use my best efforts to eradicate corruption at all levels. Colleagues, as it is for my domestic political life in St. Lucia, so I believe it should be for CARICOM as we strengthen our democracies 40 to 60 years after independence, let us all commit ourselves to the principles of good governance, constitutional reform, transparency and accountability, and let us strive to make this region the freest, most democratic, and best governed part of the universe, all in the interest of the people of the region we have been called to serve. My expectations and dreams as a new Prime Minister in CARICOM are for the attainment of genuine togetherness and integration of our foreign and economic policies. My dream is for a flexible and agile CARICOM, serving the day-to-day -day needs of our people and enhancing the faith in our collective destiny. My dream is for CARICOM that never forgets that the only reason why we have committed ourselves to public life is to serve the people. And so we must put the people first in all that we do. I would like to close with some borrowed words of wisdom. They are the words of the 1987 Nobel winner for peace, Oscar Sanchez of Costa Rica. And I quote, hope is the strongest driving force for people. Hope which brings about change which produces new realities, is what opens man's road to freedom. My friends, let, let us be honest and acknowledge that CARICOM's image throughout our region needs to improve. That must change and change now. Too much time has already been lost. We must begin that vital change by being the change the people have for a very long time been crying for. We must not only talk unity, we must demonstrate to our people that we are together, confronted by similar problems that can be resolved only by a united CARICOM. I thank you. Thank you, Prime Minister of St. Lucia. We're watching images of the opening ceremony for the 44th regular meeting of the Conference of Heads of Government of the Caribbean Community, CARICOM. We have more news coming up as our final show breaks, so don't go away.